And while we're on the subject of your little expose, all you did besides ruin my reputation was ruin the reputation of Channel 666, the very station for which you were working at the time you made it. And of which I left shortly thereafter for this new position. You see, Johnny, I have this thing called talent. I have a skill set people want and need. I'm an experienced journalist. I'm not some pathetic man-child nearing middle age who lives and acts like he's 18, who wants nothing more in life than to read comics, play video games, and eat pizza while drinking beer and hosting movies that are, at best, a mild diversion for the mentally challenged. Hey, Adam Age Vampire, Brain That Wouldn't Die, Killer Shrews, those are all classic films. Well, let's not forget your other programs, like Dr. Johnny M.D., where you live out an adolescent male fantasy by playing a macho man doctor that has all the young nurses in tight uniforms swooning over you when you swagger by. Or the rest of the trash you've inflicted on the general public over the last decade. A, a suicide game show called I Can't Take It Anymore. Hey, I just produced that, and you know what? I thought it was socially relevant. <laughs> The appalling Judge Johnny, where you actually had people sentenced to be locked up in dungeons for the pettiest of crimes with no legal authority whatsoever. They were just happy to be on TV. The pedantic undead cops, life on the street, and the Twilight Zone ripoff, The Creepy Room. You undead Johnny are a talentless adolescent, spineless, self-centered, perverted, deviant, smutty and disgusting little man. 